Hello everybody, how you all doing? My name is Ruffle and welcome to today's video. Today I want to talk about the new LMT called Avances that came with Season 2. It's by far one of my favorite, if not the favorite weapons to use right now, simply because it's at the perfect sweet spot in my opinion. It has an amazing rate of fire, not too high, not too low, a rate of fire of 750 rounds. For comparison, the PKP has 850 and the LCMT has 650, so it sits exactly in the middle between those two weapons. It has very nice huddling, it has very nice range, and it also has very nice damage. However, keep in mind that right now, all the new weapons that came out with Season 2, I think, except the new pistol, if I'm not mistaken, have the damage numbers being bugged. When you shoot somebody at the head, you're supposed to get extra damage and when you shoot them at the chest, right? The difference pretty much between headshots and body shots for each category of the weapons is actually different. LMGs hit harder at the head than SMGs. So right now what's going on with this weapon is that it has the headshot multiplier of an SMG and not the LMG. The same thing applies for the new Assault Rifle, I I'm not quite certain, I haven't played with it a lot. However, even with the wrong damage, even with the wrong headshot multipliers, Avance is actually one of the best weapons in this game, if not the best in my opinion. So, let's jump into the best setup that I found for this, so I don't waste more of your time. So, starting off from the side, of course, this is down to personal preference, you can go with whatever you like. I would recommend going with either the XDR Holo because it's a very clear, uh, minimalistic side which will not take a lot of space out of your screen, doesn't have a lot of things going on around it. A simple circle with a red dot in the middle. Another great option is the Fusion Holo if you unlock that. However, feel free to use whatever you feel comfortable with, it doesn't really matter, it doesn't change the, the performance of this weapon. Moving on to the magazine, of course, the standard issue extended magazine is my go-to with 200 rounds. If you haven't unlocked that yet, then no worries. You can use the standard issue, which comes with 100 rounds on it, which is, again, very, very nice. You then have high power subsonic and armor piercing. The high power is pretty great. It, it hits quite hard, but it comes only with 50 rounds in the magazine, and it also ruins your recoil control quite a lot, I would say. So I wouldn't really recommend it, and it also decreases your rate of fire. So, so my recommendation is that you should use the standard issue magazine until you unlock the standard issue extender mag, which pretty much is the same as the standard issue. It just comes with 200 bullets instead of 100. Now, moving on to the more important uh, attachments here when it comes to the barrels i would either recommend going with the top tactical compensator because it increases your weapon accuracy it reduces your recoil control but the recoil of this weapon really isn't that hard it's quite easy to control nothing compared to the PKP, for example, which has a pretty crazy recoil, or the M6 and A3. Avances comes with a pretty normal recoil, in my opinion, so I would recommend you using an attachment which increases your weapon accuracy, and that's why I decided to go with a tactical compensator. If you feel like you're struggling with the recoil, the Warhawk compensator will increase your recoil control but reduce your weapon accuracy. I wouldn't recommend it, but if you really struggle controlling it, that's a nice option to have. And the last barrel that I'm actually using is the Rapt Suppressor. The Rapt Suppressor, I like it simply because I always love suppressors in FPS games. I don't know why, something about the sound, I find it very interesting. It also hides you from the minimap and with, you know, Pike not being abused at the moment because it got nerfed, you're not really shown to the minimap all the damn time. So I think that suppressors are actually useful again. The only downside of using this suppressor, the RAP suppressor, is that your projectile velocity will be reduced, meaning that the range of your weapon will be reduced. Moving on to the four grips, I would either recommend going with a Cobra grip simply because it increases your accuracy while static. Now, ideally, you want to shoot when you're standing still. You don't want to be shooting while you're running around at the same time. So this is a very nice attachment to have. It increases your accuracy while being static, and it decreases your accuracy while moving. Now, if you're one of those guys who play super aggressively, likes to run around a lot, likes to run and shoot at the same time, then the LWG grip is your go-to foregrip. It's the exact opposite of the Cobra grip. It improves your accuracy while moving, and it decreases it while you're being static. So depending on your playstyle, choose one of those two and you should be good to go. So yeah, that's that's it pretty much, guys. That's my setup. That's what I've been using, and I've been having a blast with it, as you can see from the gameplay in the background. It feels to me like 
an SMG with a bunch of bullets, to be honest. The, the recoil is very easy to control. The RPM is very, very nice. The damage is very, very nice. And the range is actually very, very decent as well. So it's an all around great weapon to use. And keep in mind that the headshot multiplier is still bugged. So the weapon is actually only going to get better unless they decide to nerf it for whatever reason. But to me, this is hands down one of the best, if not the best weapons to use right now. Thank you guys for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, please make sure to drop a like and subscribe for more content. I upload Battlefield content as well as Division 2. And I'm waiting for Modern Warfare 2 to drop so I can cover that game as well. Thank you very much for watching, guys. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.